All right, all right. I'm your mana uh, with another pack opening. Now these packs I've already opened because um, I was with my brother and on the ride home he got really impatient. But uh, what I did was I repacked them, and well, I repacked these. I got some more, and I tried shooting this the first time, and it didn't work when I already opened these. So I'm just going to show you what I got in these packs. Now these are two Zendikar packs. I got two 2010 core sets and one Eventide because I play two decks that are heavy white and black and another deck that's heavy uh, blue and red and even Todd really has a lot of really good blue and black and white excuse me blue and red and white and black cards so anyway but uh, this is in the card packs and these are the commons I got some decent commons nothing really good you know like duress or anything but um, I did get some decent commons uh, but that's not what you guys are watching for. You guys want to see the uncommons and rares. Some of you guys don't even want to see the uncommons. Anyway, I got a Hedron Crab, a River Boa, a Colony Gem, and I have to tell you guys, oh, I'm sorry, and an Armament Master. So that was the first pack. Armament Master, I'm not too crazy about. Um, anyway, my second pack was Teetering Peaks. Uh, Kabira Crossroads, uh, Hagra Crocodile, Spider Silk Net, Core Cartographer, Vampire's Bite, um, Zendikar, Far Guide, Zektar Shrine, Nimbus Wings, Trap Finder's Trick, <clears throat> and here are my uncommons. Now, my uncommons go uh, Trailblazer's Boots, a Living Tsunami, Quest for the Grave Lord, and this is what I was going to say is I've been. You know, I've probably bought about 20 packs of Zendikar already, and I've been hunting and hunting for a fetch land, just one fetch land. And what I have gotten is a few rare lands, but none of them what I'm looking for. And, and I can't tell you, I probably have five of these. These fetch, are not, they're not fetch lands, they're regular lands, rare, and they're not bad, but they're not what you want. I swear, if I, I if I, they're gonna keep me. So what do the coast do? They they filter out their good rares and they stack their packs full of n cruddy rares that you don't want. And I don't know how many of those more things I have to get before I call Wizards of the Coast and say you guys owe me a fetch land. Anyway, uh, <clears throat> here's the. 2010. Now these three sets are the, the sets my brother has, and I swear he has better luck opening packs than I do. Uh, it's always been that way. Anyway, uh, let me show you these. I repacked it upside down. Here's the first one: Lightning Elemental, uh, Razorfoot Griffin, Essence Scatter, which is a pretty good card. Crawl Worm, Goblin, Piker. Dread Warlock, Soul Warden, which is another pretty good common. Regenerate, Kindled Fury, Acolyte of Xanthrid, and these are my uncommons. Now, Wall of Frost is a pretty good uncommon. I like that. Might be my favorite wall. Uh, Ignite Disorder, Angel's Feather, and a Guardian Seraph. So, not bad, but not the best. And then we picked up an even tie pack. And let me get these things out for you. Hold on. Okay, sorry about that. Okay. <clears throat> Shell Skulkin, Soul Reap, Nettle Sentinel. Fire at Will, Marrow Levitator, Battle Mage Mimic, Raven's Crime, Wilderness Hypnotist, Sins Enlightenment, Drain the Well, and Hobgoblin Dragoon. Uh, obviously, this is not how it came. That was on the back. Okay. These are my uncommons Swirling, Spr Spriggan. Lingering, 